A new version of the tiny Raspberry Pi computer is out, and this little gadget may have huge implications for the overall tech sector. So with us now to break it all down, Mike Andronico, associate editor over at Tom's Guide. So, so Mike, first of all, let's explain this. What exactly is Raspberry Pi, and how is this new version, the Raspberry Pi 3, different from its predecessors? Sure, so the Raspberry Pi is uh, essentially a small credit card sized PC and uh, it's super affordable, $35, and it does very basic computing. It's about as powerful as, as maybe a smartphone. And uh, what's special about the Raspberry Pi 3, the newest version, uh, it's 10 times faster than the previous model, and it introduces uh, wireless, uh, wireless internet as well as Bluetooth compatibility. So it gives it a lot more use cases for, uh, for both hackers and you know, maybe people that want to use it in the classroom, things All right, like so, that. So let's talk about those use cases here. So how do you think it's going to impact the overall technology world as a, uh, as a whole here, especially as people try to embed more technology into their homes? We're talking, of course, about this IoT or Internet of Things phenomenon. This is what the Raspberry Pi is targeting, right? It's allowing developers to try to, to get a basic framework for how to, to integrate circuits and integrate technology into certain things around their home, right? Absolutely, yeah. The, the Raspberry Pi isn't designed to replace your standard desktop PC. It's very much for these smart home gadgets. And, um, you know, that's why the newer model has wireless, so that it could, you know, per perhaps control your lights. Uh, let's say you've built a robot, you want to use the Raspberry Pi to control it. Uh, so it's really uh, bringing Windows 10 to this whole Internet of Things um, ecosystem and you know, giving you a way to power all these interesting devices as those types of products get more popular. Now, Mike, you mentioned Windows 10. Raspberry Pi, we should clarify this right now, runs on a more scaled down or type of version of Windows 10. How might this new version affect Microsoft, the, the maker, obviously, of, of Windows 10? Yeah, so this, this could be very big for Windows. I think it establishes Windows as a platform that's more than just you know, what you use for your everyday computing or what you use for work. Uh, this brings Windows into the whole smart home world, I, I think, and um, you know, you'll, see it, you'll see a lot more creative uses of Microsoft software, you know, such as all these Internet of Things devices. And I, I, think, I think it's good for Microsoft. I think it, it, it brings them to a really interesting new place. So this Raspberry Pi phenomenon, uh, again, a building block for developers, a building block for some gamers out there, a building block for people who want to tinker, but it could ultimately have some big implications for the overall technology world, specifically with regard to Internet of Things or IoT. Thank you so much. That's Mike Andronica over at Tom's Guide. And thanks for watching. I'm Dominic Chu. Have a great day. Hey YouTube fans, I'm Landon Downey from CNBC. Thanks so much for checking out our channel. Here you'll find videos packed with all the info that you need to be smarter about your finances. Be sure and subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me to see CNBC's original series, Young Money, Tech Bet, Kramer's Mad Money, and all the latest from CNBC.